My name is Rajkumar Raj. This is my eighth year as a full-time faculty and I've been uh, uh, part-time for a year, so I'll say nine years. The YVC offers multiple different things. I mean, it's a, lot, it's a smaller campus, um, there are a lot of different things which can be done here. Um, for example, the engineering program is a wonderful program. It's a smaller program, but you get everything you need to get from, a, from an engineering program here at YBC. We have uh, excellent dedicated faculty um, on campus who can help you. We have multiple different resources where if you have any problems can go get help from. Uh, we have the math lab, we have the speech lab. The um, international student provides um, a different culture to the campus. I mean, they've been extremely um, focused. They know what they want to do and what achieve in their lives. That they do a lot of do calculations. So they're building a bridge and they're doing calculations. And it was nice to see the team saying, okay, they're saying if I put so much of load, how much will the bridge withhold? I mean, that's pretty much the aim of the project, but they go in a little bit more deeper than what I expected the freshmen to do. So that was interesting to watch them do as a team project. So. A drone, in other words, or also called a quadcopter. We did it for the local industry. So they wanted something, instead of hiring um, an airplane, which is so expensive, they do it once in 10 years because it's extremely expensive. So what they do is they want something to go fly up, go around, take photographs of a complete uh, video of everything and then come back and they can go and, uh, go and analyze it. So I can actually show you a drone we built for them. And this can actually fly uh, for 15 to 20 minutes nonstop. And we tested it, it worked extremely well, but uh, we still have to work a lot more on it because of the wind. So the, the project I'm talking about is this paper bike, which is a competition which is held at Eastern Washington University every year in spring quarter. So the thing is they need to build a bike out of paper, um, maximum 75 pounds. They can have a, not more than 10% of non-paper. But it's an excellent experience for the students. I mean, this is something which has changed most of the students in that program when they went for this event, came back and everybody got a job because that's one of the things they put up in the resume saying, we did this, uh, they put some photographs of the bikes and everything in. I'll make sure that I can take them to a field trip in, in most of the classes. Like um, the one of the engineering intro to engineering class, we go, go on three field trips. Easy to sit in and listen, but it, it gives, they learn a lot more by going to a company and learning what they do inside the company. Like for example, we are going in two weeks to GE, the aeronautic company. Our main goal is to make sure all these 20 or 30 students who are coming in, help them out to achieve what their dream is. So that is one of the things, being such a small uh, department we are able to do. We actually had the maximum number of transfer students in the engineering program um, last year. We had almost 19 students who transferred to either UW Central, um, Idaho, as well as to Pullman. Um, so that's one of the things, and I've always told them saying, Take your lower level classes here in a community college. It's an extremely small department, very few people who, you, who are in the program. So there's a lot more person to person contact. So like for example, mo any of the engineering classes um, are anywhere between 10 to 20 students. So you learn a lot more being in a small class because you get a one to one attention from your instructors. So that is the biggest difference you gain from here and I mean you gain from YBC.